field day on Friday taught us anything, it's that we and our kids are ready to get outside and let loose. Yeah, it is time to plan family vacations, but are you a little rusty on what to take and how to pack? Well, we have experts ready to show us some packing hacks. Kara Huffmeyer and Amber Hollenbach from Happy Lark Home Organizing are here. You brought a lot. We so <laughs> show us what you yes. want to show us first because yeah. we're starting over there, right? We are starting over here, but the very first thing I think when you're starting to pack for a trip is really getting together a list. I think that just keeps you right. on track. I keep one in my notes on my iPhone. I edit it per trip and I check it off as I go and I think that really keeps you Organized. I'm, yeah. I'm the same way because you think like how many outfits yes. do I need per day? How many pairs of underwear for the kids? How many different pairs of shoes? Yeah. And then it's the other things that you don't think about like your vitamins and yes. Tylenol for the kids. Or like maybe you need sheets or right. something for oh. like a beach house or something. So yeah. Much. And so I much. think too like designating a spot in your house so that you can pack you know, a little bit each day and you're not doing it all at once and you can have a drop zone area like okay I grab the toothpaste it's in this spot and right. then you kind of pack it all in as you on that one whole day. Little kind of by situation. little. It's not yes. as daunting right yes. at the last minute. Yeah. yeah. And we think using these packing cubes have really been a game changer for our family. There's four of us. And, you know, having each one assigned to a kid and to myself, my husband, really makes a huge difference. Harper, she loves to put an outfit together and know that that's what she's grabbing in one day. So I literally fold it all together. That's so then her outfit. She, she comes in oh, in her packing cube and she has her outfit so for the day. So she can just pull that out. She's yep. not digging around for digging. the shorts to go with the. Which right. my son likes to do it individually. So he'll have a whole shirt, you know, bag and then a whole short bag. And his gets messy, but the. The best part about these packing cubes is you just shove it right back in when you're all done and zip it up and you deal with it when you get back home. Right. And then I think too with this is like don't bring an extra laundry bag. Just reuse one of these. Take all the clean ones out. Put all the clean together and then pow all the dirties in. You don't need to fold it. Zip it up and shove it in a suitcase. And, and then that way that's, that's just what's coming home. You with know that's wash. your dirty bag. Yep. That's and there's great. a bunch of different kinds that you can buy different colors. So you can assign a color to each kid, each person. And so then, then that they way know they know which bag is which. You which are awesome. organized. Oh. I know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And a roll. You need to roll. It's a game changer. I was going to gonna say the roll, roll, roll. You know what the thing with the dirty clothes on the way back? You have don't you have to roll them too? And I just I, shove it. Well, I was saying to you, I can never fit everything on the way back yeah. from the trip that fit in on the way out. So if you designate one suitcase too for dirty and one for clean, I yeah. think that makes a difference too. That, we've okay. done so that then like, too. Yeah, everyone's dirty clothes are all in one. So Amber, what do we have here in front of you? All right, so if you wanna keep your shoes, they're dirty bottoms, mm -hmm. there are these great shoe bags, you can put your shoes in them. Another thing we like to do is since all your clothes are in your packing mm -hmm. bags, or packing cubes, you can put them just in the bottom of the suitcase and they're protected from your clothes because your clothes are in the packing yeah. cubes. Yeah. So smart. Um, and then toiletries, you, yes. there's a lot of options for toiletries, but the key things are to make sure it's waterproof, something that if something were to leak, you'd be good to mm, go. That shampoo, um, it gets me sometimes, yeah. you know? <laughs> this lotion. one, yeah, the lotion. you can hang it when you get there and it also, when it folds up, it's nice and compact. To fit, it's just like a packing cube. And now, where would you find something like this? Amazon, Container Store, Target. There's so many options out there. Um, you know, just put in your search engine, packing, packing toiletry cube, and you can find it. And we'll also link them later on our social media oh, so great. that you can find them. Something with this though is like you don't have to unpack this each time. Leave this packed, mm -hmm. so then you don't have to re-pack the whole right. darn thing each time and just right. replenish it after each trip. Right, you were talking about jewelry before. Yes. So talk to us a little bit about like keeping the jewelry and other things. Okay, yeah, all the little things kind of, you never know what to do with them. So um, we have different options here. There's a small little jewelry case. I love this one. It's like a little file for your jewelry and it just folds up, will fit right Something. in your bag. Little so pockets for smart. things. So um, smart. And then, you know, if you don't have one of those and you're about to go on a trip, no problem. Get yourself some. Good old press and seal. Get out. Pop this it on is, I here. I wondered why you Just had this sure here. Just make sure you make okay. a little like um, lip on it, or else it like sticks. You need something to be able to pull it and apart. And now your jewelry isn't going to get. Your necklaces aren't going right. to get tangled. You can put rings <laughs> oh on it. Oh my That's gosh! So smart. You can put so smart. bracelets on it. You can even fold it in half, and then you know, stick it in. Goes and right in there. This little contraption, Kara. Awesome, yeah. We love this too. Tech. Oh my gosh! Because yeah. you know, when you're looking, this right. is for your carry-on when you're looking for those chargers, mm -hmm. or you don't know where to restore them if your charger is not all tangled up. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, Everything has kids. a spot. All the kids are like, "Where's my charger?" My yeah. Dying. Yep. Right in here. Give Pass it, it to help. them. They can grab what they want. And then we also love these 
zipper bags. Uh -huh. They're, you know, you can use them for so many things. Your toiletries, if you don't have one of these. Snacks for the kids, like, you know. Wet baby oh, suits. Owen, here's oh, your snacks. Oh, ben, great. here's your snacks yeah. on the plane, and it's not like snacks flying everywhere or activities, things like that. And if you do it right, it will look like this in the yeah. end. Yes. Okay. Not when you, not <laughs> not when you come home. home. Not on the way home. Good, the way because there. mine would yeah. never look yeah. like this yeah. on the way home. It's all awesome. Shove it on the way home yeah. and just oh. get it shut. You guys give us hope. Thank you yeah. so much. Yeah. We Thank appreciate so much. it. Yeah. And like they mentioned, they're going to have all the links to this. So if you're right. interested in any of these items, yeah. we'll have